Welcome to Fret Not. My name's Rob. My name's Colton, and welcome to the Entry Level Metal Series. Hey guys, uh, thanks for tuning in. If you don't know anything about this channel, uh, we have went out, this channel's went out, and we've purchased entry level guitars uh, after doing tons of research that we felt like you could buy at a really budget friendly price that will actually be decent guitars. Mm -hmm. So all you need to do is go to Fret Not One or go to Fret Not Guitar Reviews, either, both on YouTube and uh, get on the page, find one of the guitars that's in a giveaway, like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel, and then type the words D-O-N-E into the comments under the video, and that puts you in to win a guitar. Yep. Welcome to Fred Knott. My name's Rob. My name's Colton, and welcome back to the Entry Level Metal Series where we have a new guitar from Firefly. What are you holding? This is the Firefly FFTL Ghost. So if I'm sure you do know this, if you watch anything around in metal or whatever, or hard rock, you've seen John Five, he has one of these, but <clears throat> his is a Fender. Made it special for him from what I understand. I don't know all the particulars about it. Mm -hmm. um, I saw one online today for seven grand. There you go. Right? Seven grand for a well, John Five. Th this is definitely not seven grand. Um, so what we're going to do, um, just so everybody knows, if you saw the intro, you know what we do. We buy these guitars out of pocket, we review them, and then we give you guys, the viewers, a chance to win them. Uh, it's really easy. All you have to do is uh, like this video, share this video to a different platform, um, be subscribed to the channel, and type the word done, D-O-N-E, D -O -N -E, in the comments, and you'll be put into the drawing. Um, <clears throat> so on the specs on this, I'm not really sure... I think it's a mahogany body. It's got a lot of weight to it. Um, the uh, neck is a roasted flamed maple, and it has a lot of flame to it. Mm -hmm. um, it has 22 stainless steel ball-in frets. It has um, a bone nut that's red. I'm it not is sure red. what animal they killed to get a red bone <laughs> nut, but there you go. Um and straight out of the box, it's set up. The action's low on it. Um, and it has a kill switch, which is like your favorite little toy. <laughs> so when I first got this guitar, I, I played a little deal on it. You're going to get to hear that in a minute. You'll get to hear it in the mix. We're going to do something a little different on the mix tonight. We're going to let you hear Colton's version of the mix, and we'll let you hear a, a deal I did. And the deal I did was kind of more rock where his was a little heavier. And at first, when I was putting it together, I thought, well, man, the pickups, they're a little underwhelming compared to what I thought they would be on a John 5 guitar. Mm -hmm. um, after I listened to the mix, it, they actually sound you know, pretty good. And then we listened to Colton's mix, and they actually sound really good on his. So we're going to let you kind of hear both sides since we don't do a clean on it. Um, we're going to come back in a couple minutes. We're going to tell you the price point on this. We're going to let you hear this in a mix. Um, we have a lot of stuff going on on the channel right now. Um, some of it's kind of behind the scenes that maybe you guys don't know about. So we'll give you a little info. So we have another guitar coming in that's copied off another famous person. Oh, yeah. Something to do with, like, uh, Root. It, it, was it Root or something Tree? Roots, or Tree, Branch, branch. <laughs> Trunk. I don't know, but you'll see. But that'll be here this weekend, and then we're gonna we're gonna do that one for you guys next week. Um, also, we got together. It, I did not start out to do this, guys. Uh, I've gotten a lot of emails. We, we've getting a lot of messages on the page. So, uh, and don't let this be a precursor that you can just call message us and bug us until we do <laughs> something. But we gave, we caved in this time. So what we're doing after the tree branch or whatever that one is. Yeah. Um, we got together with our local luthier. I know you guys are here kind of probably more so for inexpensive guitars. So there's three gaps out there to me. There's an inexpensive guitar, a high-end guitar, and then there's people that build their own guitars. Mm -hmm. Not luthiers, but just people. Yeah. So we got to talking about it, and so what we decided to do is we bought a kit off, offline. We're not going to tell you much about it tonight. Um, and that kid ought to be here in the next day or two. And I called my luthier and I said, Hey man, this is what I got. This is kind of where we need to be. What, what can we do? So he said, well, let's just get this kit. Um, and we'll, uh, 
put it together. We want to take all the stuff off of it that comes on the kit because honestly, that's what makes it inexpensive. And because we're fret not, we're doing something a little different and a little more high end for you. So we're going to replace a bunch of the parts on the kit. And um, as you know, we called our buddy in Canada. We called Mr. Cody at Aurora Tone. And I said, look, this is what I got. Can you, do you have anything that will work for this? Do you have anything you can put together for us? So long story short here in 10 days, 14 days, whatever it turns out to be, we're going to have a guitar designed by us from a kit. And when we get it ready, Colton gets to pick the color. So you can't say nothing to me about the color of the guitar. Whatever. If gonna it's like it. pink and purple, you can't say nothing to me. <laughs> so Colton picks the color of the guitar. Our luthier is going to put it together. Cody's shipping us pickups specifically for what we're doing. And um, we listen to the emails. We listen to the comments. It will have fret knot on the headstock. Give me a fret knot signature series guitar. It may be the only one that is ever made <laughs> on this planet, but it will have fret knot. I ordered the, the slide for it today, had it, a guy work it up for me. So we got parts coming from all over the country. That's what's coming up for you guys. And we have a lot of other stuff. We've told you about the other luthier that's building this guitar. It's probably going to be mid-October. We're going to take you guys with us. We're going to let you inter introduce you to him. We're going to show him all that. We're going to show you all the parts from the luthier's side. We'll let you sh see what he does. And then you guys are going to be with us for that whole deal mm -hmm. until we get that guitar. But no, we're not giving that away. But the fret knot <laughs> guitar, we're going to give away. And it should rock. The way should. we're doing it, it should rock. Mm -hmm. It should be a really nice guitar. All right, so tonight's live is a little different. We're going to do one with Colton, and then there's another one after it with me, just to show you the difference in the pickups on how they sound. Uh, because we don't do clean stuff, we don't never have time to do two lives on a video. We're, we work all the time. That's so It's not true. We just can't play clean. <laughs> So that's what we're doing tonight. You'll see two lives. So right now, we're going to shut up and let you hear this in a couple of mixes. And we'll come back and talk price point, how we got it, what we think about it. Is it worth your time? Yeah. We'll be right back.
Okay, we're back. You got to hear a couple of different ways that sounds in the mix. I know my thoughts on it. What are mm -hmm. your thoughts on it? I really enjoyed playing this guitar. It uh, it sounds really good. It's it's the at, like you said, the action's low, but there's like no string buzz. No. Um, it sounds really good. I just it's a blast to play. Um, I'm kind of jealous we're giving it away. I'm going to be honest. And it's got that kill switch, which <laughs> you know, I've. It's because I've never had a kill switch before, so I, I, I don't really know what I would do with it other than just, you know, kill it. Right. But it's, that's a lot of fun to tinker around with and incorporate some cool ideas into some jams. So I don't know this to be true, but I believe this is a plastic material, but I promise you it, is a, yeah, it yep. is a fingerprint magnet. It is not metal, and it, you're going to need to carry a rag. Um, and I really love how they put the trust wheel spoke down yes. at the end. Mm-hmm. That's really cool. Man, playability, you know, I mean, that thing plays really good. Man. It plays real good. Straight out of the box. All I did was tune it. It's in drop D right now. Um, I, I mean, I'd put some different strings on it if it was me, but hey, nobody's going to sell you a guitar for, you know, these these lowering guitars with high-end strings on them. So we paid 226 or 229 for this shipped. That's not terrible. And just so you know, Firefly, they do have an Amazon store, but you can go to Guitars Garden website, Guitars Garden, and that's Firefly's website. And it's, they're actually, their shipping uh, post or whatever you want to call it is actually in LA. It's in Los Angeles. So that site has guitars that Amazon doesn't. And you can get those guitars almost pretty much. I got it like three days. And um, you don't go through the Amazon stuff. And because they have different selections available on there, that to me is better for me because they always have the same three or four guitars on, two or three guitars on Amazon yeah. by Firefly. Yeah. So that's a good thing to keep in mind. Um, I think overall that's a steal for the money. But I'm about to break your heart if you're thinking about buying one. So I got it. I had it. We've had it two or three days. I played it the first day. I got kind of lost and played it for a couple of hours. I went in there and I, was, I walked by my wife and I said, I'm just going to order one of them for me, man. I'm going to put my pickups in it and mm -hmm. that's going to be a, you know, maybe put a different color knob on it or whatever. I said, but that little guitar plays amazing for 225 bucks. Yeah. And went on Guitars Garden, sold out. So I either got the last one or somebody got the last one right after me. But hey, they put them up all the time. Yeah. So. And it's, I mean... It's sold out for a reason. It's it plays pretty good. I uh, just you got just to hear that it out there. Yeah, you got to hear it. I mean, we ain't done nothing to this guitar. You know, a lot of times we got to work on guitars, and we ain't touched this guitar. All we did was tune it. And uh, the you know, at you know, the most you would need to do to this is just put some different strings on it. Yeah, I think it it sounds great as it is out of the box. If you want to change the pickups, you know, that's up to you. If you think you need something a little bit more aggressive, I I think they're fine. They sound really good. Mm -hmm. The fretboard plays amazing, and and the ball in frets are just a nice touch. It's you know it's a rosewood fretboard, I believe, and it's it's just done. <clears throat> as much as I hate to say this, big box builders, big brands, uh, you guys, man, if the world ever finds out how well a few of these low end Chinese companies make guitars compared to what you sell. For four times the price, uh, you might be in trouble, man. Yeah, I mean, you could, like you said, you could buy something like this and just upgrade the pickups, and you've got something that competes with big, big box. Well, and, an and another thing, you know, you're not going to, I looked, and the other day I was looking at something that was like a 1000 bucks or 1200 bucks, and it still had nickel frets. Mm -hmm. And I'm not saying anything bad about nickel frets, man, but if I buy a guitar, I ain't never selling it and never getting rid of it, and I don't want to look down in four or five years and see the frets didn't end, you know, yeah. from me slapping on the neck, you know, so that's why I play stainless steel. Mm hmm all in all, man, if you got 226 bucks and you don't buy that, it's on you. Yeah. Um, the only drawback, if there is a drawback, is maybe you don't like white and red. I don't know, man. That's pretty unique. I kind of dig it. It's, you know, you don't really <laughs> see this kind of scheme going on too often, especially with that shiny plate. Well, I will say this. I've said on this channel two or three times about different guitars in the 15 or so we've given away that, you know, I could do a couple things to this guitar and I could play this live. Mm -hmm. 
I'm, I'd change the strings. I wouldn't touch that guitar. If I were to do one thing aside from the strings, it would maybe be put a black plate on it. <laughs> That's like it. the mirror? That's and what makes it. I don't really, I mean, I see myself enough <laughs> and that's too much throughout the day. So a and I will tell you this, nice. it is a fingerprint magnet every mm -hmm. time we get through playing it, we have to wipe it down. But hey man, that's a really good little guitar. It man. is. I, I like it a lot. Definitely get in on the giveaway. Yeah, you want to get in on this giveaway. And if you're looking to buy a guitar, man, that's a steal. Mm -hmm. That's that's a that's a fret not approved steal. Yeah, I, if anybody else has reviewed it and they've, you know, dogged it or anything maybe they just got a bad one because this thing is it's pretty golden well you know i've seen three or four reviews on it over like a month or two period and i kept waiting for it to come up on amazon and it never did and i thought well i'll just do some searching and i went to, on amazon and i looked at uh, the firefly and it says firefly store and you click on it and that takes you to their section of it mm -hmm. and then in the very bottom i seen guitars garden and i'm like well oh, crap i'm just gonna go to that and i went to that shit they got a whole bunch of guitars that amazon don't have Nice. And it didn't say one left in stock. It just, you know. Oh, I didn't tell you. You probably saw it in the picture. But that's a string through. Yeah. Um, I just, man, I don't know if there's a bad part of this guitar that I could negatively review. So. Not too much. I mean, change the chrome faceplate to black. <laughs> that's my negative review. <laughs> Well, as you guys know, we don't get paid nothing from nobody. Every bit of this is out of pocket, and if it sucks, we will tell you. But, man, that's that's got to be in the top one or two we've ever reviewed yeah. straight out of the box yeah. for that money. If well, I feel like maybe if you were to put it in C, you would maybe pick up on some rattle. But, but you will on the – well, you will because it's set up for D on that yeah. one. And if we put it in drop C, I'd change the size of the strings, and I would, set the, I would reset the intonation and set up on it. And man, that's a that's a lifetime guitar for two hundred and twenty six bucks. Yeah, it's that's pretty good. I hate to say that because I have a lot of really expensive guitars. Dude, this this blows my very first guitar out of the water, and and I paid almost as much uh, for that guitar as this one cost. And I I wouldn't even have thought of looking for another one if this was my first guitar. That's a good guitar, man. Uh, I hate to say it, but it is. And I will tell you this. if In a future video, you're probably going to see me with one after we give it away because when <laughs> it comes back up, I already told my wife. I said, I'm going to buy one of them just for the heck of it. Yeah, it's, it's a, a good nice guitar. Mm -hmm. That's a good guitar. All right, guys. So we got tons of stuff coming up for you. And just so you know, we're not going to give it away yet, but the kit guitar is going to be, as far as what we spend on it, it don't mean it's better but as far as what we spend on it would be worth two or three times what the fees are worth by the time we buy the kit we buy the pickups we buy the tuners we buy the bridge we put real strings on it uh and then we pay to have all that done it's gonna be worth a little bit of money yeah i'm excited about that one all right mm -hmm. well like i said if the colors are weird on it yeah can't say nothing to me because he has the authority on the colors i ain't gonna do it so. it's gonna be good it's gonna be good <laughs> Listen, guys, man, I always wait till the end of the video, but I feel so horrible saying this at the first of the video. I feel like I'm standing out here begging with my hands out. Our memberships are live. We have people on it. We would really appreciate you guys if you can afford to get in on the memberships. It's not much a month, man. It really would help us. Every little bit helps us kind of keep the lights on, keep being able to buy these guitars, being able to give them away. Be able to make Frankenstein guitars. Right, right. Mm -hmm. And um, also... We have uh, a super thanks button. If you <clears throat> can't afford to get into a monthly deal, you just want to donate to the channel, man, we'd really appreciate that. Anything helps. Um, and, you know, you don't want to see me in 10 episodes divorced. Yeah, because he <laughs> bought too many of these <laughs> for you. Right. All right, guys, look, you guys are amazing. Uh, every one of you, we appreciate you, man. I, my, my phone goes off. Our phone goes off all the freaking time with messages and stuff. We get emails. You guys are really cool. We appreciate you. And we're going to keep doing what we're doing. And you're going to get the inaugural first ever, maybe ever, fret night guitar. Mm -hmm. that's, uh, that's, that's exciting, you know? Some one of you guys is going to be able to say, I got fret knot guitar. Right. And so it is different. Uh, it's going to be a 16 string. No, I'm just kidding. It's going to be a different style. 24 uh, string. Right. It's going to be a little bit different style Man. in the body. We, we changed it up. I did not want to do the same thing everybody else has done. So we changed it up a little bit. I think you're going to like it. And uh, if my buddy at Aurora Tone Pickups has anything to do with 
that sucker's going to scream, man. Mm-hmm. All right, guys. Well, listen, we appreciate you. Uh, please like the videos. Please share the videos. Even if you're already subscribed and you're already in on the drawing, just share the video again somewhere else. The more people get on here, the higher quality guitar we give away. Mm-hmm. And until next time. Stay tuned.